Republicans are going to help elect Elizabeth Dole to another term in the United States Senate. In a race that's become surprisingly tight, Elizabeth Dole is hoping to get by with a little help from her friends. The first-term senator is an experienced Washington hand, a former secretary of transportation and labor who once headed the Red Cross, wife of one-time presidential hopeful Bob Dole, one of the first female graduates of Harvard Law School, known for her grit and grace. Barack Obama's made real headway here, and that's helped pave the way for the emergence of a little-known five-term state senator named Kay Hagan, who now has a good shot of winning. I think the key is Liddy Dole brought this on herself. She's been in office for one term, and she really hasn't done anything. I go across the state from Murphy to Manio, and people cannot tell me what she's done. I would say certainly jobs, jobs, jobs. <laughs> helping our textile and furniture manufacturers, uh, the fact that we were able to save our public hospitals $330 million two years in a row as the lead Republican handling those issues. But Dole's biggest negative may be the R next to her name, which in this traditionally Republican state has almost become a scarlet letter. President Bush campaigned for you tirelessly in 2002 when you first ran, but he hasn't really shown up in North Carolina <laughs> this go-round. Why is that? Well, his father has been here, and Laura Bush has been in the state a couple of times. And smelling blood, the Democratic Party put out this ad. I've read she's 92. Did I just tell you she's 93? One that has some Dole supporters seen red. What's happened to the Lindy Dole I knew? She's just not a go-getter like you and me. She votes with Bush 92% of the time, and she is ranked the 93rd out of all of her 100 colleagues. But do you think it was insinuating that she was too old? Because many Republicans were very angry about that. You know, Katie, everybody knows Elizabeth Dole is not 92 or 93 years old. She's 72, though. She's not 92. Do you think that ad was a snarky attack on your age? Mm-hmm. I think I think it was uh, probably designed to do that. Does that make you mad? No. You know, like I say, I stay focused. Early voting and half a million newly registered voters are giving Hagan confidence. And she says the economy is beginning to convince even conservative Democrats who long supported Republican Senator Jesse Helms. And I've been talking to a lot of farmers that are full, fully on my in, in my court. A lot of the other people in, in eastern North Carolina because it's jobs. It's the fact that their wages have fallen. But the Dole name and the Dole brand may neutralize the negative attacks. And this steel magnolia is not about to become a shrinking violet. God bless you. My mother lived to be four months short of 103 years old. I've got a lot of years to fill and a lot of vim and vigor and passion for what I do.